Labels. Short words or phrases affixed to things, people, ideas, just about anything really, indicating the particular categories or classifications to which they belong. Labels do come in handy. For instance, to keep a household manageable, heeding the time-honored maxim, we want a place for everything and everything in its place, don't we? Dirty clothes go here, clean clothes go there, to the places they belong, so we know where to find stuff, because, well, things are where they are supposed to be. All is copacetic and everybody's happy, right? But, as logical and convenient as it is to have a designation for everything and everyone, middle schooler Jude astutely observes that while labels do help people to know what to expect, sometimes labels stop people from thinking. She speaks from experience, part or all of which possibly you or someone with whom you are acquainted can relate. So check out Jasmine Warga's book entitled Other Words for Home from your Carmel Clay Public Library and see what you think.